You may have noticed I haven't updated in two or three days. My uploads have been sporadic, simply because I've been overloaded with Twitch cancer. Literally, every time I turn around, my phone goes off, I check my emails, I check my Instagram or whatever. Someone sends me a link to something so stupid on Twitch, I literally need emergency chemotherapy. <laughs> Which results into me not wanting to touch, you know, social media. I don't want to get on YouTube or anything, because it's like, I know what the people want. They want me to look at this Twitch crap. And it's killing me. It's killing me, Stu. So in typical Twitch fashion, there's going to be a couple Twitch videos today or within the next 24 to 48 hours, depending on how much I care to get into this shit. Anyway, Velvet7 was banned from Twitch permanently. But we all know that when it comes to, wait, actually Twitch partners are the ones that aren't permanent banned. If you're banned and you're not a Twitch partner, but an affiliate, you might be able to come back in like a year or two. I mean, for God's sakes, to let low tier God come back. And you might be sitting there going, Gundam, who the hell is Vanity7? I'm probably better off letting Billy tell you who Vanity7 is. Billy Let's dream. Vanity7 is a Korean Twitch streamer known for doing very fun Twitch streams that are very interactive. And it promotes health and good living by getting you up out of your chair to make you want to dance with her. Look at her dance. In the 80s, she would have been the equivalent to Richard Simmons. I used to be 450 pounds before I watched her streams. Now look at me. I'm nice and thin. Mmm. Oh, baby. You know what I like. Ooh. Shake those boob meats. I love those big dirty pillows. You could suffocate me in them, baby. Put them in my mouth and make me suck them. She is a Korean Twitch streamer that is famous for doing what every other t female Twitch streamer does in the site, dancing around. That's all she does. I mean, that's literally it. And she's not even a good dancer. That's what's insulting to me personally. She's not even good. You know, remember those Motley Crue videos? Girls, 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 da, 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 da. And you know, and some chick comes out. She's in a low cut top. She's kick spinning. She's going off the pole. Vince Neil Skitty, you know, the good old days. When a chick who danced for money actually could fucking dance. Remember the movie Dance Fever? Well, let me tell you, if Vanity 7 was in it, it would be a fucking comedy. Because her dancing's that atrocious. It's horrible. The appeal of Vanity 7 is, she's like... I believe the term the children use is thick. Am I right, Stu? She's thick, right? Thick is a slang term for a full-figured body, specifically a big butt and curvy waist. It is both used sexually and humorously. So when an Asian girl has some sort of curves, she still doesn't have an ass, though. But when an Asian girl has some sort of curves, people just lose their mind. It's like a black girl with blue eyes. You don't see it coming, but when you do, you're infatuated. So she's got big boobs and she dances. That's pretty much it. That's all there is to it. They've got nothing else for you. <laughs> I mean, for God's sakes, Twitch is so full of these girls. It's ridiculous. It is truly ridiculous. She does have majorly huge boobs. So when she dances, they do like really jiggle around like Skyrim boob physics when you mod the shit out of it. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I got suspended on, on my Twitch channel. <laughs> I got banned bro. <laughs> Those are crocodile tears if I ever saw them. Cry me a river bitch. Billy and I work for free on this dying channel. So they gave her the can. They literally got rid of her. She got banned for the third time. She's screwed. She's seriously screwed for God only knows how long. She's trying to appeal. And frankly, I'd hate to do this, but I have to defend her on some level. I mean, I'm not, I'm not. Like, I'm not saying, like, I think it's, like, really unfair, you know? I really think it's unfair. Like, one time, 
Okay, now I can say one time I got banned because I was wearing skirts and I was wearing shorts under it. And then they banned me because they they banned me because there was a short showing under it. But another another streamer did the same thing, but she didn't get suspended. Like those I had a bunch of those kind of things, so that's why I was like why? <laughs> Why it's only me? Some people in her fan base have actually come out and said, well, if Vanity's banned, then they, they name dropped Alinity and uh, who else should be banned? I think they said Amaranth, you know, the queen of the thoughts. She's like the Luke Cage of thoughts. So people have come to this conclusion. Honestly, this is true. I mean, they're right. Like, the fact that Vanity7 was canned for doing the exact same thing countless other girls do on the site, but if they're partnered, they're fine. And if you're not, you're screwed. She's got a point. They've got a point. Some other fans on her site. This is great, though, dude. Kuraya Crescent said, Never bring up other streamers when you're trying to appeal. It's unsightly. Really? If Vanity7 wants to name drop while trying to appeal her ban, she has every right to. Because frankly, she's doing the same thing, but she's the one who got smoked. I mean, it's like you show up to the Kennedy assassination and you got a bullet when it was meant for somebody else. That's probably not a good analogy, but you know, if you got the bullet, you'd be pissed. And on top of that, why is he trying to say it's unsightly? I mean, for God's sakes, it's Twitch. This isn't the Disney Channel and you're not signing up for the Mickey Mouse Club. It's Twitch. Twitch is literally this. Twitch thoughts. And then there's the professional gamers. And in between, in this little space that no one gives a shit about, is where the rest of us live. Other things, you know. Where does ISIS get the money for trucks and tanks? Is it not the whole big conspiracy of the, like, because they sell, like, oil for dirt cheap. Isn't that, like, what guys- OH! NO! That's not bad. God that a good damn to me. it. The <laughs> fucking <laughs> hell, dude. Interesting. I'll be watching right now. See? Do you, do you just want me to shoot? Wait, he got eyes on us! Oh! He's shooting oh, at us! Oh my fucking god! <laughs> on the vehicle, dude! We gotta go! That's no, fine! How do you think? <laughs> oh, oh! He did! Oh shit, he did! Twitch TV, it's a Gundam, you fucking pleb. All hail Zeltix and Ricardo Milos. I.e., guys and girls that don't do sexually exploitive stuff. So it's either you're a big name thought. Or you're trying to become a big name thought, or you're Shroud, Ninja, or Dr. Disrespect. All the rest of us can eat a dick. In fact, we can eat a bag of dicks. My God. Really though, I, I, it's like I'm, I'm, I agree with her that she shouldn't have been banned when other people are doing the same thing. On the other hand, what she's doing isn't work. You know, I'm sorry. This is like, really, this is nothing. It's, it's nothing. She dances on the level of a child. There's no skill here. It's just nothing. This is like what chicks do in their front room. She just decided to turn on the camera in between having a snack or something, you know? And I'm supposed to sit here and go, well, she's a businesswoman. How's she a businesswoman? You call this a business? If I was working at the bank and a girl came to me like, hey, I need a loan. And it's like, okay, welcome to Johnson & Johnson's banking. Uh, how can I help you, miss? Uh, what do you need a loan for? It's for my business. Okay, how much do you need? I need like $10,000. What is your business based around? Oh, okay, like I need a really good computer with like an i9, I don't know what it all is. I'm just gonna go to like Origin PC and have them build it for me, uh-huh, okay. And then I'm gonna get a camera, right? Okay, I'm still waiting for the business part to come in. Okay, here's the part. I'm the, the product. I turn on the camera and then I dance around and shake my boobs. And that's my product, that's how I make my money. I'm a businesswoman. It's just, the bar for businesses got so goddamn low. Look at all the shit Henry Ford had to do to get a business up and running. Look at Sam Walton. Now a business is basically turning on your camera and shaking your body in front of it. Jesus Christ. There's a lot of dudes that really need to get laid. I mean, if you can't get laid, buy a hooker. I mean, for real. Maybe sex is a woman. Might just, maybe that's why I look at this shit and I go, it's garbage. It's because I've actually had sex with women. I'm not trying to knock a dude who hasn't gotten any action. But if you're like seeking this out to throw money at women for doing positively nothing, you might have a problem that only a prostitute and blow can cure.
you know, a line of coke, a couple hookers. All of a sudden, you're going to wake up and go, what the fuck was I giving this girl money for? And she was just dancing. Not once did she take on my balls. Then it's like, the, it's like the, you get the red pill. I will come to your house personally dressed as motherfucking Morgan Freeman. Wait, no, that's the wrong black guy. Whatever, doesn't matter. And I will give you the red pill. <laughs> Welcome, my child. Now you can see the world for what it is. A big ass Ponzi scheme and your ass at the bottom. They try and get your money. Long live Sonic. Yeah, I think I'm done talking to this chick. I basically explained to her the whole bot system and she probably was just like, okay, yeah, this guy thinks I could possibly be a bot. Fuck him. And it's like, no, I don't really think you're a bot. A bot would have better pictures. Look at those boobs jiggle in slow motion. Ah! Ah! Feed me, mommy! Oh god, no. Oh god. Why would Twitch take down her channel? It's good quality content. I um, love how she teaches me Korean through the power and the medium of dance. Anyang ho. See? Educational. Sweet boob meat. There's nothing wrong with that. Twitch needs to get their act together and help this poor girl make more quality content. Mmm. <laughs>